And welcome back to my channel. Ang ina talaga dito. Like, it's so hot. Babae ako ngayon. Babae ako ngayon. Hi, Mavex! Ayan, welcome back sa ating channel. Ayan, medyo Mimi Yu na Americana. Oo, na you do not. <laughs> Anyways, okay, Mavex. If you follow Norvina on Instagram, know how hard she works pushing out products and helping create a major campaign for her brand. Okay, so sa mga hindi nakakakilala sa inyo, she is Anastasia of Beverly Hills founder's daughter. Ayan naman, beauty is in her blood talaga. Okay, so back in 2018, the first Lorena palette launched with primarily purple hues, which is her favorite color and my favorite color as well. And when it comes to this new palette that we're going to review today, it has more shades and a lot of colors. Pero may taglay bang kapangyarihan ang bagong Norvina palette na ito? In this video, we're gonna find out if Norvina's Pro Pigment Palette Volume 1 is Beggified or Beggified. Kaya naman, tama na mga chika chika. Let's go ahead at mag tenke na tayo. Wah! Voila! Okay, so na kile na tayo. So I'm gonna get the box. So this is the box that I got from Norvina. Wah! From Anastasia Beverly Hills. And this is the box. Now, Anastasia's Beverly Hills have served us some serious palette this year. First, we got a taste of things to come with. The anything but the basic, which is the Riviera palette. Then came an even bolder number from none other than the Alisa Edwards palette. And sinundan ng YouTuber, which is si Jackie Aina, which is I don't have that palette, I'm really sorry. With so much newness, yes, newness, we assumed that we'd seen the last of the palette launches. For now, at least. But not so quite, mga bek. Ladies and gentlemen, wow. <laughs> Boys and girls, allow me to introduce the latest ABH palette, which is the Norvina Volume 1 palette. Okay, so Mob X, just want to clarify, I am not part of the PR list. Every time that I purchase things from ABH, I make sure that I'm going to get the PR package thingy. So just we could feel that influencer fantasy. Mm hmm. But if you guys are interested, the PR package that comes with an eye primer is retail for $75. And the eyeshadow palette itself is retail for $60. Okay, so now let's open it. Like what I mentioned earlier, there is a primer right here. And the PR box is really cute. May mga lines, ineme, and then mejo holographic king exena niya. If you guys would notice the color change. I think that's holographic thing. And there is an Anastasia's Beverly Hills na brand name sa unahan. But at the back, it's just plain. Now, when you guys open this PR package, you will notice this heart na merong um, logo na Anastasia Beverly Hills. Then, sa loob, you will see Norvina's palette, which is the volume one. So now, let's open this motherfucker right here. So my box came out pa siya na color black. I think para lang to secure it and hindi masira yung palette. And then there's this square thingy paper where it says the shades, I guess. And yung mga claims ng mga shades. Sabi dito warning not intended for use around the immediate eye area. Okay, so now let's talk about the packaging of this. So this advanced artist free palette is a beautiful square cut 
purple case with gold accents and the ABH X Nervina logo on the outside. And when you open it, there is an extra large mirror on the inside as well. This is really different. I really thought that it's kind of different. There are some shades here that I haven't seen before from Nervina, which is I'm really, really excited. Okay, my pecs, this contains 25 shades. And they are put in the oversized pants, if you guys would notice that. And like what I said earlier, there are some iconic shade colors in this palette. Daring bright, and of course, some vibrant shades. And one of the claim of this palette, this is formulated without gluten, parabens, and phthalates. Okay, so what are phthalates and parabens ba? Aside from being hard to pronounce, they are hard on the human endocrine system as well. A lot of cosmetic brands are considering phthalates and parabens among hundreds of other ingredients is dangerous to sa ati, reproductive health, and breast tissue. Ah, brainy. <laughs> Nag search a kiss. <laughs> okay. So, I'm not going to do a lot of work in video. Okay, so I'm going to start swatching the A layer and the B layer. Because the names of the shades is not easy to understand. There is A1, A2, A3, A4, A5. It's the letter E. That's the ones that I used to use always in school. Yes, in school. Okay, so I'm going to start with this two layer first, which is the A layer and the B layer. Okay, so this is the first layer. And ito naman yung second layer. Alam mo, akala ko magkaparehas lang siya. Kasi if you would notice these two colors, parang magkaparehas silang dalawa. Ano ba, Norvina, naglulokohan tayo. So, dumako naman tayo sa third and fourth layer. Masyado kong Tagalog ngayon, okay? Okay, this is the third layer. And this is the fourth layer. The third layer, I, it's kind of giving me a different vibes. And I really think this is in Jackie Aina's palette vibes, right? Okay, so pagdating naman sa fourth layer, um, papunta siya ng America's Independence Day. Chara! The, the mustard hindi masyado lumabas yung kulay niya. Sana ginawa na lang nilang color yellow para super bright ng palette na to. I'm not really living for this kind of color, the mustard. Kasi sometimes they're really hard to palabas. But I think that was just me. But that's my opinion, okay? Now mga Bex, let's go ahead with the last layer. I'm living with this E1. Ang ganda niya. Para siyang ang kakaibang peach na shimmer. Kaso tong E3. Hindi ko alam. Hindi ko mag-gets pag din yung isura niya. But, my favorite here is this one. So far, mga favorite na ako. I'm kind of like excited to use this. Okay, now mga Bex, let's make a look. Di ma excited ako eh. First off, we're gonna start priming our eyes with this Anastasia's Eye Primer. This primer patagal ng patagal, I get used to it and parang nagugustuhan ko na siya kasi nalalabas niya talaga yung kulay nung pigment ng eyeshadow ko kaya I'm not really really mad about it na. Okay, so first off, I'm gonna start with this shade A2 and we're gonna pack that in our inner crease and then build up the color as well. Okay, in fairness ha, kakaiba siya. Swear, kakaiba siya sa ibang purple na nahawakan ko ng ABH. It's so easy to blend. Then I'm gonna go with the D4. And then we're gonna pack that in our crease as well to build up the color. Then I'm gonna start putting some on my outer V as well. And then I'm gonna go with this A5. And I'm going to put that sa taas ng crease ng color pink na yan. So, itong color blue na to, we're gonna blend it pa loob. Then, we're going to cut our crease. Then, ang pinaka-importante ginagawa sa pagka-cut ng crease is to blend the edges ng inyong kinemerot. Para maganda yung effect niya. Oh, di ba? Sinong mag-aakala ng ganyan? Oh! Wala to! Ano ba kayo? Ito? 
Okay, so now let's go with the V3. And then we're going to put this in our inner corner. And then I'm gonna flip my brush. Since ito yung wala pang nalagyan na pigment, I'm gonna go with the D2. And then I'm going to put this in the middle of my lead. In fairness, hindi ko kailangan ng setting spray to wet it para lumabas yung kulay. It just, you know, it's doing her job. So, I'm kind of happy with this. Now, I'm gonna blend this too para maganda yung transition niya. Then, patungan natin ng color pink again. Not bad, not bad, boo boo. Then just blend it para maganda yung effect ng mata nyo. Nakita nyo yan yung... Oh, diba? Para pag may tumawag sa inyo mamaya ganito. Yes? Ano ba kayo? Ganyan na, ganyan, ganyan. Then I'm gonna go with this E1. Gusto, gusto ko talaga tong i-try E1. Pero ayokong ma-E1. <laughs> Then, ilalagay mo lang yan dito mismo sa pinaka-transition ng pink and blue. Then, I'm gonna get some of this color white na shadow, which is a C1, para sa ating brow bone. Now, kukuha lang ako ng wipes, and then, i-wipe ko lang yung gilid-gilid na hindi ko best. Then, I'm just going to finish my face and then lashes, stuff like that, so I can proceed with the lower lash line. I will be back, okay, mga Bex? Which is, it's a YouTube world, two seconds or one second. And sa totoong world natin, it's like two hours. <laughs> okay, so now we're back and we're gonna go with the lower lash line. For my lower lash line, I will be using this A3. Then I'm gonna go back with this D4. And then I'm gonna go with A5. And then you're gonna put that sa ilalim ng color blue. Then I'm gonna go with color white, which is this C1. Then for my inner corner, I will be using this A1. Bitch, the shimmers, they're not playing, like, pop out again. Like, oh my gosh, I really like this color too. I just it Okay, so now that eye makeup is done, I'm just going to pop some lashes. Ooh, gandang bata. I forgot, I wanna go with this A1. And then we're gonna smoke out the edges ng ating shadow. Not like that. Ooh. So, um, I'm gonna go back with the Kat Von D's, which is the thing I made for my contour. But this time, I'm going to use the Subconscious Shade. And then we're going to kind of like chisel our face. Okay, for my blush, I will use MAC Like Me, Love Me. So I'm gonna start using this Backseat Love by Morphe for my lip liner. Then, papatungan ko siya ng Kylie Jenner's Coco in the shade Baby Girl. Then, I'm gonna use this Jeffree Star's The Gloss in the shade Candy Drip. Okay, then for my highlighter, I will use Jeffree Star's highlighter, which is the Supreme Frost in the shade Diamond Wet. Okay, so in my opinion, I think that is enough. We're gonna go with stoning our face. So, kukuha lang ako nitong um, rhinestones in Emerald. Then, ibibikit ko yan sa gilid-gilid ng aking mata. Then, I'm gonna go with these pearls. Then I'm gonna go with this red rhinestone. Wow! Oh, 
ba? Diba? Tinapos natin ang rhinestones. At tinapos ko na rin ang pa-ice cream enamelatic na ginawa ni Norvena. Sinabayan ko na rin ang rhinestone dito. Hindi ko na masyado ginawa or ipinakita sa inyo kung paano ko ginawa to. Kasi, if I'm going to do that, um, hahaba tong video natin. And I'm sorry. Okay, so now, para sa aking final look, I'm gonna get this set and spray and isiset lang natin ang fest natin. There you go mga Becks. Ayan, o oh, babae tayo ngayon kasi nakabuhok. O, oh, may pabuhok tayo. May pabuhok si Mayora. So yun ang ganyan sis. And ayan, I hope you guys like this look. And sorry kung hindi ko na masyado naging na detailed na sa inyo kung paano ko ginawa tong cone in emerald with the rhinestone-ish. Kasi mahirap siya. Mahirap yung pagiging straight niya kasi hindi ako straight. So mahirapan ako sa mga ganyang bagay. But um, I'm really happy about this look. I like the pigments of it, and then the Nirvana vibes is there, and then the cones. I kind of like change it a little bit in a way na medyo parang kakaiba naman sa kanya. Kasi wala ako ng mga rhinestones na meron siya. Sa kanya lahat ng klase ng bato nilagay niya sa pes niya. Oo. So mga Bex, ayan, nakaabot ka dito sa portion where we're going to see if Nirvana's palette is... Beckified or Becky Knight. Okay, so let's talk about the pros first. The pros for this palette is really good. Um, I love how it's really easy to blend and hindi ako nahirapa. May mga palette sa Anastasia Beverly Hills na kapag nag-blend siya and nagsama yung colors, it's kind of muddy. Kamakailan ko lang napapansin yun kahit sa Alisa Edwards. May pagka-muddy na nangyayari. Unlike dito, wala akong nakita. I really like how it's blended. Mas maganda yung formula na meron to kesa dun sa ibang palettes. That's what I noticed, ha? That's for me. Iba yung formula niya. I feel like it was more powerful. Wow. It's more of um, improved than before. And when it comes naman sa shades, mga Bex, you guys could go with the neutral colors. This could really play with this palette. And the pink vibes, purple vibes is there, which is Nirvina's favorite and my favorite. You guys could actually have this kind of Jackie Aina's vibes. I think Jackie Aina palette. Eh. Feeling ko talaga ito yun eh. <laughs> eh meron tayo ni Baklay. I'm really, really happy about this palette. I love it. I love the shade. I love the packaging for the fact that the pan, the pan is bigger than the usual mga becks. Tingnan nyo naman. The pan is square. Mas malaki siya sa mga nilalabas nilang eyeshadow palettes. And one thing that I really, really like is the name of the shades, which is it's not really hard anymore. Minsan siya nga pa naman si Bakla, oo. Hindi ko mapronounce yung mga shades nila, but this one, it's so easy. I mean, if if someone is really asking for your look, you could be like, oh, I use A5. What? With a mix of A3? Mga ganoon, gusto nyo yun. The shimmers is good as well. Hindi mo kailangan basahin yung brush mo just for the shimmer to come out. Bitch, look at that. Look at that. When it comes to my cons, my bex, I'm sad how yellow is not here because this one is. <laughs> I'm not really living for like a mustard event, mustard scene, mustard situation. Maganoan. I really wish na nilagay nila yung yellow dito. And also, my bex, sana ito hindi na nilagay ng shimmery. Medyo shimmery siya pero hindi ko talaga shimmery yung eksena niya. Pero kung ganon din naman nila labas, sana hindi na nilagay ng glitters. Oh. Para may intindihan nila ako, ano? Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, wala naman ako masyadong na ayawan na. Kasi lahat, kasi the, even the mirror is perfect. Like, ang gandang bato. Charak. Even the mirror is really, really perfect as well. It's really big than the usual. And of course, kung magta-travel kayo and ayaw nyo na ganito kalaki, hindi to magkakasya sa bag nyo. Pero eto na nga, is Anastasia Beverly Hills Norvina Volume 1 Palette. Is Beckified or Beckinide? This palette, mga Bex, is Beckified. I'm not really that huge fan of ABH. Kung papipili mo pa rin ako, Jeffree Star versus... Um, ABH, of course, Jeffree Star ako. But this palette was really different from other palettes that I've experienced. And there you go, mga Bex. Pero syempre, hindi natin makakalimutan ang lagi niyong inaabangan. Wow! 
No, alam nyo, sobrang, sobrang importante sa akin tong comments of the day. It's actually comments of the day kasi I have top three commenters. Mga Bex, I really, really appreciate each comment that I'm getting on my channel. Kaya I have this comments of the day. Medyo, medyo madrama ako ngayon. Kaya naman, syempre, wag na wag natin kakalimutan ang comment of the day. Comment of the day! Comment of the day! Comment of the day! Comment of the day! Hey! Hey! Comment of the day! And eto na sila! Once again, mga Bex, thank you, thank you so much for watching. And kung meron kayong mga friends out there na gustong matry and mas makita kung anong meron sa Norvina's Volume 1 Eyeshadow Palette, of course, share this video. And please, i-share nyo to para dumami tayong mga kabaklaan, okay? Marami dyan. Hindi lang nila nakikita ko. And, syempre, if you guys like this video, don't forget to give me thumbs up. And if you guys are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Para naman sa mga bags natin dyan na laging gusto ng updated, hit the notification bell button right there. Para sa king upload ko, you guys are always updated. And once again, thank you so much. And see you on my next video. Mwah! Bye! Girl, girl na girl ako ngayon dito sa Boko Pop. Ganda!